Hey folks, welcome back to our channel. So look what the elves brought us. Well, look what the elves brought me, an Instapot. An eight quart Instapot. So this box is pretty big. And I think I showed you the Spanish side. So let me show you the English side as well. And I'm about to open it. And um, without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and get into this it's the pot because I'm going to make, we're doing a what's for dinner series and I'm making meatloaf and gravy and mashed potatoes all in one with this instant pot. So I'm going to open this. I'm not going to bore you with opening the whole thing on camera. Well, I'll speed it up. But mama got a new toy. Yes, honey. Well, you, you pull the pot and I'll pull the box. That's right. That's why I had these big, strong boys. All right, you, you want to focus the camera on it? I didn't even know I was getting this. So what a nice surprise. So... It came with cooking timetables and all those what nuts. Oftentimes I say, don't get me appliances. Well, oftentimes I request not to give me appliances, but I'm happy with this. I'm fine with this. So There's a setting for soup and broth, meat and stew, bean, chili, cake, egg, slow cook, saute, that's the delay and start, cancel, pressure cook, yogurt, that's neat, sterilize, steam, pressure level, keep warm, porridge, mmm, Goldilocks and the bears would like that, <laughs> multigrain, rice, I think I'm gonna like this, yep. So we are back, we have done the, we have cleaned up the pot, we have done the test run where you, you have to, like boil some water or pressurize some water to make sure that the whole system works. So we have done that. So we are about to get this meatloaf going. So I'm going to use my regular meatloaf recipe. And here it is. We use, zoom it in, sir. We use and have been using ground turkey for probably like 15 years. And that's just what we like. And you can use whatever ground meat you use. We're using two pounds of the ground turkey. So I have two mini loaf pans. 
that I'm going to put the meat in. So to the two pounds of ground turkey, I have a half a, half a cup of breadcrumbs, and then I have a teaspoon of Worcester, Worcestershire sauce. Yes, Worcestershire mm -hmm. sauce. Mm, a third cup of milk because we don't want this marvelous meatloaf to be dry. And two eggs. This is my trash bowl. Put those in there. And I did take my wedding rings off. Just so I don't have to clean them. Now I'm not adding any salt to this because I use, I make my own um, lip and onion soup mix. So that's why I don't use any salt, so. And I'm not putting any onions in here because, well you just heard me say, lip and onion soup mix, then I make my own. And then you just get all up in here. Mix it up. You don't want to get it, you don't want to over mix it because that can make it tough. And in that Lipton onion mix, onion soup mix that I make is garlic powder, garlic powder, onion powder, beef bouillon, and onion flakes. So that's where the flavor comes in. I want to show you the pans that we have. These are medium loaf pans from Walmart. I have probably paid like a dollar forty, if that. And so I got the meat loaves in the pans, and the ratio of fat for the turkey is eighty-five fifteen. If I use the ninety ten, the Meatloaf is going to be dry. The 80-20, too fat. So that's what we like, the 85-15. If you want it to be more healthy, but the turkey is already healthy. But if you want it to be more healthy, you can do the 90-10, it's your preference. And if you want it to be greasier, <laughs> sloppier, you can do the 80-20, um, the it's up to you. And I was lazy tonight. I'm not going to say lazy. I normally make my own cream of whatever, cream of chicken, cream of celery, cream of whatever, but I did pick up a can of the cream of mushroom with garlic to make the gravy. And um, since I've never used this, I'm not gonna use the whole can because I don't want it to come out of the pan and get onto the potatoes because I do want to do the mashed potatoes. But I did put like two dollops with this serving spoon. Per, per loaf, spread it on. And then when we um, take it out of the pressure cooker, I'll put some more on it and we'll run it into the oven just to get it hot. And then we'll see if it, um, the next time we do it, if we can put the whole can on it, then that's what we'll do. And let's get this bad boy going. We took the potatoes, let's see Christian. We have two pounds of potatoes in the pot you gotta have liquid a red because uh, i've never done this this is our first time two pounds of potatoes red potatoes we left some skin on there with two cups because you have to adjust the liquid per the size of your instant pot so we have two cups of liquid because if you don't have liquid you're not going to get pressure and we're going to cook it on high pressure for 20 minutes i found a recipe 20 minutes, so let's get this baby going. We have the basket thing in here. Some people call it a trivet, some people call it a basket, so I'll say that interchangeably. 
let's get this baby going. 20 minutes. Put these, um, it says two can fit in there, but it's acting funny, Christian. Oh, wait, 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 I think wait, the wait. basket's upside down. Basket's upside down? Mm -hmm. Look at these things. No. It looks like it's supposed to hang off of Let's those. see. Hang off? No. It's right. I think you're supposed to stack the, um, stack the meat, the loaves. Like that. Yes. Yes, honey. And then, so, you take the lid. Let me turn it around for you, friends. Are you showing this, son? Um, you want me to zoom in? What? You want me to zoom in on the, um... The front? Yeah. For the novice users? And you have this little arrow. And I, I pressure cook with an old fashioned pressure cooker. So I'm not afraid to pressure cook. Um, so let's do this. There's an arrow. There we go. And we're going to push, now you gotta put the camera down here, Christian. We're going to push pressure cook. The pressure level needs to be high and the time is going to be 20 minutes. And that's it. fingers. Oh, wait, wait, wait. One must put it on ceiling. Right here. Or it'll vent <laughs> the whole time you're cooking it. You gotta put it on ceiling. Or it won't build up pressure. and the blocks that I've been reading. It takes like 10 minutes to build up pressure, so we shall see. We'll be back. Make sure you're liking, commenting, and subscribing. <laughs> Houston, we have pressure. Okay, so it has, the timer has just gone off. 19 minutes and the recipe says to let it release 10 minutes naturally and then manually for the rest of the way. Okay guys, so the pressure has been released and I also read that if the food isn't done, then you can put it back in for like five minutes. So you have to check the center of the meat. So let Okay, so I read, well, just like you're cooking. Well, you cook it in the oven. You check the center. It looks done to me. Does it look good, Gracie? I think so, too, pumpkin. Mm. Yum, yum, and it looks moist. Let's see, is it super hot? Mommy can take it out. Without the oven mitts. This one might. Let's 
see you guys. Let's check this one, Christian. With the doneness. Yay, yay, yay. Good luck, dog. Okay. So my plan was, and I think still is, so next time, next time we know, because let's look at the potatoes. The gravy did not overflow into the potatoes, so we still have great potential for mashed potatoes. So let's see if we can still make some magic. And we can actually turn the oven on for I don't want to waste this good old cream of mushroom and garlic. Right, guys? Oh, I'm so excited. So, 20 minutes, two pounds of ground whatever. The Andersons used ground turkey. It's so moist, I can't wait to plate this up. Yes, honey. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Is it supposed to look like that? Yes, it's meatloaf. It's supposed to look delicious. Does it look delicious? It looks delicious. It looks delicious. It kind of looks like soup. Well, that's the gravy. <laughs> which will go on to the mashed potatoes. Y your mommy is happy. I really don't think we need to put this in the oven, but. C'est la vie. Is that French? We. Oui. 20 minutes. It was just 20 minutes. I am going to become a pro at this Instapot. Why do I keep saying Insta? I'm, I More keep, natural. I keep taking the, leaving the tea off. So you're gonna pour the gravy on the mashed potatoes? Yes, ma'am. Inside the case thingy? In here? Yeah. No, on my plate. Mm. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? They are gorgeous. 20 minutes. This instant pot is a game changer. My dinner, our dinner, is ready. Look at me. <laughs> Was prepared in 20 minutes. Two pounds of meat. And the potatoes are ready. So I'm gonna show you guys in just a moment how it's going down. I am so happy. I, was, I didn't even, I didn't even, I cannot even talk. I didn't even ask for this. I have been just thinking about it. I guess I was talking out loud. Look at this. Look at this. Get my thumbnail, Christian. I think I want this to, I, this is gonna be, this is going to be my thumbnail. All right, folks. So here is the final product. I'm not a big eater, but I had to show you 20 minutes. Look at this deliciousness. Look how moist. This is ground turkey, our favorite. It's still steaming. It's so good. 
That gravy. I kicked it up with some broccoli. I'm not gonna eat this whole plate. <laughs> And that thyme, I love using thyme. Excuse me. Mm. Let me just put this down. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Thank you for joining us. On my first of many meals, this is the first of our series of what's for dinner with only the Andersons. Come back because next week we're gonna have another what's for dinner with either our Instapot and I got another gift and I'll show you that one. I don't know when because I might do another inst instant pot of what's for dinner. I, I wanna do one more bite of this meatloaf. It's y'all. And these potatoes. But we thank you for watching. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. And also, make sure that you check out that Crispy Chops. It's right here. That Crispy Chops video. And as always, hit that, that notification, notification bell. bell. What they said. <laughs> <laughs>